I have been the proud principal at Cass Street for eight and a half years now. I believe we're preparing students for success in the future through leadership, also through problem solving and collaboration. Students are working together on projects. They're pushed into collaborating and team building and preparing for things like the STEM fair. We're preparing them for any workforce you have to know how to collaborate. I like the STEM programs because you get to do like a different variety of STEM. The hands-on part, the learning about engineers' backgrounds and stuff like that. I like working in the Project Lead the Way Lab because we do a lot of STEM related things and we can build robots and stuff. I mostly like participating in the STEM program because it's a lot of hands-on activities that I can do and I'm more of a hands-on person. I've been at CAS for 13 years. Um, in our current position, we are preparing our students to be the future leaders of STEM. Currently, we are allowing students to believe that they can do whatever their minds imagine. My push especially is for girls to let them know that they have to make their mark on the world, to look at things, to figure out how they work, imagine designing them, taking things apart. First starts in the mind, and then they can do it with their hands. With that work, it comes with a lot of preparation and showing kids that with hard work, you can achieve anything. There is a high rise of uh, apartments for senior living, and our students have actually helped design one of the apartments. We have worked with the construction team and gone over and viewed the site. So that's a major partnership with uh, St. Rita Square next door. My Project Lead the Way teacher, Ms. Bates, she helps even after school. Like if I need something, I can call her. Well, my math teacher, Ms. Edwards, she helps with a lot of stuff, like she do a lot of math. We work with numbers, high numbers and stuff. I think it is helpful for um, each child in the NPS district to have some type of STEM experience. There is no way you can compete in today's market and not have an equal level playing field. There's no way without the exposure that you will be successful. And when kids see the exploration and the imagination, it gives me a certain positive outlook because a lot of things that we think kids can't do, I see them do. I'm just very proud of what we've done here at CAS with STEM. Uh, we have a lot of challenges. Our students come from, uh, many of our students come from high poverty backgrounds, but we're giving them an opportunity to actually meet engineers, visit Rockwell Automation, hold hands with engineers, talk to engineers, design things with engineers, and to open their horizon for their future. So I'm very proud of that fact.